Hi, um, I just wanted to make a quick video about something that's really been bugging me. Um, it's about, uh, people who want to get modified or, you know, like, you know, that stuff about tattoos and piercings and hair colorings and whatnot. Now, um, I, something that I really want to stress is that, you know, the whole thing about it, it's getting really popular these days, which is cool. And there's a lot of discrimination that goes on with it. Like, I get called a freak sometimes because of my hair. Like, they're like, they point at me, like, you're a freak. It's like, okay. Um, but even though it's going down, it's still there. So something I really want to stress is that you are going to get judged, obviously. But the thing that really I had to think about before I wanted to do any of this was think about what you're going to do when you're older. Now, this is something that really annoys me, is that when you go to like a job interview and you're like, hey, I want to get a job here, yeah, even if you have great qualities, you know, they still may not hire you because of your piercings or tattoos or colored hair or whatever else you may have um some jobs may accept it like places like hair styling places and piercing shops and you know creative most things of the creative genre um allow that but things like if you wanted to go work at babies r us <laughs> and you had like a like a a lip piercing, that's just probably won't fly, that probably won't fly. Um, I don't know what will happen in the future, but as of now, it's not going to happen. Um, so please, before you get these things done, please consider what you want to do. Like, if you want to be, um, oh, I don't know, a teacher, and you have uh, tattoos that are visible, like, you know, lot of tattoos and a lot of different piercings and obviously if I walked in to a teaching place and was like hey can I get a job even though I have like basically you can't even see my piercings just my hair let alone they'd be like uh no <laughs> most likely so just think about what you want to do for the future I mean I'm still trying to think of it so at this point in my life I, I'm using high school is to think of what I actually want to do. There are a lot of things. Like, I really want to be a piercer, but I don't want to do that for the rest of my life. Um, so just think about that before you go and get a job. The future may change. I'm not sure. Hopefully it will. But for right now, we've got to put up with all the shit that comes with it. Um, and just think about your future. Like, if you want to be a teacher and you still want to do all this stuff like colour your hair now like while you're still a teenager or get you know piercings that people won't see like belly button piercing or genital piercings like there's nothing funny behind that by the way <laughs> it's a normal thing um get tattoos that you're not gonna show like on your stomach or something like that there's easy ways to get out of it you're just gonna have to put up with it until all this crap that comes along with the discrimination goes away. And it really sucks, and um, I know it does, and I get made fun of, but you know, that's just the way it is. So please, please think of that before you go and get stuff done. Please. <laughs> I don't want your future to be fucked up. I really don't. Okay, that's it. That's it for my ranting. Um, I apologise for, like, three bad words I said, but I just... It's a nice emphasis on what happens. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Okay, bye.